Howdy do, howdy do. It's a dark shade sort of day. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Welcome, welcome. Come on in and join us. You are here. Hit that subscribe button if you want to join us. Thumbs up if you approve. Thumbs down if you disapprove. You are watching another, and I can't even talk. Got this cig in my mouth. You're watching another episode of the Tony White Show. Welcome, welcome, one and all. Welcome to the show. And uh, we got a guest for you. But before we get to the guest, I've got to tend to some other business. Let me see what's on deck. What's on deck? Well, first thing's on deck. Uh, I wanted to talk about Adolf Caesar. Adolf Caesar is an American actor who was born in 1933. He died in 1986. He was in several movies, um, one of which was Soldier Story. I'm only going to mention two. Another was The Color of Purple. And uh, just a heck of an actor. Left us much too soon. He died. Um, he had a heart attack. Let's put it this way. He died in 1986, but he had a heart attack. He was, he was, I believe, on set of a movie when he had the heart attack, and then he was rushed to the hospital, and uh, he passed away later. But I wanted to mention to you uh, Adolf Caesar because I just thought it well enough to mention that really a great actor. And um, I've got a guy here who's going to do a little uh, acting skit, uh, a portrayal of uh, Mr. Caesar uh, from the movie Color Purple, if you remember that movie. He's got legs as big as a baseball bat. Mm-hmm. Own daddy won't even have nothing to do with her. Talk she's about no more it. than a juke joint Jezebel. What? I hear she got that dirty women's disease. No, not the dirty women's disease. <laughs> that was a reenactment of the lines that he had in that movie Color Purple. Now, granted, that guy wasn't Adolf Caesar, but uh there you are. Anyhow, hey, and I've got a guest for you today, an old friend of mine. Yes, 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 an old friend of mine. Johnny, should I get to Johnny right now? Or should I get to some other things on deck right now? Let me get to some other things on deck right now, and then I'll get to Johnny. The last video that I put out, I was talking about Francis Ngannou, myself and Crusher. And I failed to mention, because I couldn't remember the name of the guy, one of the guys that he had knocked out. That person, I have since found out who he was. It was Alistair Overeem. So if you guys want to take time to check that out, the fight between Francis Ngannou and Alistair Overeem. I could say it was a good fight, but it wasn't much of a fight because uh, Francis Ngannou disposed of him uh, pretty easily, uh, but it was a massive, massive knockout. Oh my gosh, a massive knockout. But uh, that was the fighter who I couldn't remember and I was trying to think about. So therefore, I wanted to bring him to you uh, and, you know, tell you who he was. So there you are. So now you know. And also, I was watching an interview. Uh, it's an old interview. I know it was um, with Diamond Williams, the drummer of the Ohio Players. And man, Mr. Williams can tell some stories about the days, uh, in the early days, I should say. He's still with the group, but in the early days of the Ohio Players, he was telling of a story one time where they were doing some shows with James Brown. I think he said they did 20 shows that year with James. And, you know, uh, that's what would happen. You know, groups would would be on the same bill with other groups. You know, he had mentioned one time they were uh, on the same bill one time with the Jackson Five. Uh, but this particular time they were, I think, on their last show with James Brown. Well, Diamond Williams came off stage and James Brown stopped him and he said, uh, in that James Brown fashion voice, he said, uh, 
hey son, uh, how come y'all didn't play uh, Brick House? So Diamond said, James, that's the Commodores. And James looked at him and said, damn if it ain't. Yeah, damn if it ain't. So uh, there you have it. That's a, a story that Diamond Williams told about James Brown when they were coming off stage and old James got him mixed up with the Commodores. <laughs> Rest in peace, Mr. Brown. You're still a class act. Anyhow, let me get to my guest right now. Uh, I haven't talked to him in a whole bunch of days, in a whole bunch of days. He's probably a little bit, you know, sideways with me. Uh, and I'm not going to even call his, should I call his name? Yeah, I'll call his name. Oh, Johnny. Come on in here, Johnny. Talk to me quick. Hey, boy, where you been? Uh, you know, doing my been thing. Been a while since I done talked to you. Yes, it has been a while. You acting like a stranger. No, I just been busy, Johnny. You know, doing the yeah. show and whatnot. Well, I've been checking out your show. Thank you. Appreciate been that. Having all kinds of things going on and yeah. whatnot. Well, you know, just doing my thing, Got man. Got that boy Crush on now. Yeah, Crush has been with me quite but a you bit. Ain't called me. Well, I called now. you now. I called you What's now. What's that all about, man? Like I said, been busy. Ah, uh, you're telling it lie. No, any no, lie man. You can come, come on, with. Johnny. I'm not gonna tell you any lie, man. You my boy. I don't believe you. You my boy, Johnny. Oh, Johnny been doing his thing down here. Good. Hey, have you seen my boy Uki? No, I'm just hanging out down here on Woodshop. Come on, have you seen my boy Uki? Huh? Yeah, but I've been checking out your show. Ah, uh, okay. Have Ain't you been the same without old Johnny, though. Yeah, true Since that. you true don't that. call me true no that. more. True that. But answer, yeah. answer my question. Surprised you call me now. Well, yeah, I called you. You've been in hiding or something. No, I haven't been in hiding. No, not at all. Yeah, old Johnny been doing this thing. Have you seen Uke? That's what I, I want to know. I haven't talked to Uke. Okay. Not in a while. Okay, well. Not in a while. I got to get him on. That's all right. You know? Johnny go hunting and fishing by himself. You know, the weather's warming up down here now. Okay. Warming up everywhere, I can man. get out there and roam the land. Uh-huh. Going down to the creek. Okay. And do what Johnny do. That's true. You know how it is. I certainly do. I certainly do. Yeah. Well, listen, bro. Well, so I tell you what. Yeah. Tell I'm going to run on. Okay. I'll catch you later. That you will. Yeah. And we'll get together, man. Next time, uh, we'll talk it up a little bit more. Yes, we will. We'll chop it up. All right, down. Okay, man. Okay. Oh, As Johnny, always. Check you later. All right, Johnny. Take it easy. That's my boy down in Woodchop. In Woodchop, Arkansas. Old Johnny Weasel. Well, folks, there you have it. What more can I say? I mean, I talked about the Godfather of Soul. I talked about Adolf Caesar, uh, Francis and Ganu, of course, and uh, talked about Diamond Williams of the Ohio Players. Uh, is there other things I have here on deck? Yeah, I have a few other things here, but I'm not going to talk about that right now. We'll hey, save it for another time. It'll be here, and I'll be here if you stay there. Come back and see me next time on the Tony White Show. Be well, everyone.